Brainwaves is a high school neuroscience curriculum where students use low-cost, portable EEG devices to measure their own brainwaves. This next-generation science standard aligned curriculum focuses on student-centered learning and hands-on activities. Over the past four years, the Brainwaves course was implemented in 25 New York City public schools, reaching over 600 students. The program resulted in increased STEM engagement, student self-efficacy, and interest in STEM careers in student populations that are traditionally underrepresented in STEM. Um, students have an, an innate interest in uh, mental health, um, in mental wellness, um, but they often don't get chances to study it, talk and talk about it, and even do experiments based on um, real life neuroscience. So it's just one of those, it was just one of those really transformative experiences where students really got to feel like they were actually scientists and they got to do science and even um, answer questions that had never been asked before. The program begins with a summer course for teachers and a group of scientists who act as mentors in the classroom. As the cultivating project for the summer course, teachers and mentors worked side by side to design and conduct a mini investigation using EEG equipment in a similar way to what students would experience in the program. In the first half of the course, students explore the structure and function of neurons, brain anatomy, learning, and memory. They do so by exploring case studies and investigating their own behavior. Students engage in hands-on activities to enhance their learning, such as observing electrical activity in their own muscles and dissecting sheep brains to learn about brain anatomy. I liked it because it's different from what I'm used to working with and it feels more real because those EEGs, they make you feel more like a scientist. In the second half of the course, students are introduced to EEG technology and learn how to measure their own brain activity. Based on these observations, they develop an investigation on topics related to their day-to-day -day lives, like how music relates to memory and how playing video games relates to concentration. At the end of the course, students develop posters to share their findings at the Cultivating Brainwaves Symposium. Curriculum materials and professional development resources are available on our website. This project was made possible by a Science Education Partnership Award from the National Institute of General Medical Sciences at the National Institute of Health. We would like to thank all participating teachers, schools, and students for our success in this project.